Hello Saj, welcome to my channel. This is your reading for How Do They View You. This is for the month of May and this is for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus and North Node. If you are here to view a message for Saj, even if you are cross-watching, there might be a message for you. So let's see how do they view you. How is your person viewing you? Sad spirit. How do they view Saj for the month of May? I often wonder how our life would be if we decide to stay together. You are inseparable. How do they view sad spirits? Sad something rising in us and not more. I like to make you feel jealous because it gives me assurance that you are still holding on to me. Don't ignore me and Last message spirit, how do we do Saj? At the bottom we have, whatever I do, wherever I go, you are always in the back of my mind. And we have three more messages. I ignore you because I'm trying to forget you. I'm scared of relationships and I'm healing. Let's clarify these cards. But for now, I'm getting your person is thinking about you a lot and they, you are inseparable. They are thinking about a live, live in relationship or even marriage. King of Pentacles is here. So. Let's clarify these cards. Also, this person could make you feel jealous because they just want your reaction. They just like to see whether it matters to you or not, whether you are possessive about them or not. And don't ignore me with I ignore you because I'm trying to forget you. We will clarify these cards, but maybe it will happen at the end of May. But for now, I'm getting things are good. Also, I'm scared of relationships and I'm healing. So, Either you or your person is scared of a relationship because of a heartbreak. That's for some of you I'm getting that your person feels that you are you need to heal from a previous relationship you had with someone or it could related it could be related to your family as well that you need to heal from that situation because this is about relationships it could be a love relationship or issues in family as well we will clarify these cards so, open them down. <laughs> two of cups with i often wonder how our life would be if we decide to stay together this person loves you <laughs> this person really loves you ace of cups <laughs> Why are you here then, if things are fine in your life? Okay, you are inseparable. This person is very much in their feelings. They are viewing you as someone with whom they would like to spend their life. They want to share their life with you, share their love, share their home, something like that. This person is very much in their feelings and they want to have a new start with you. You are inseparable, please. For now, I'm really getting that this person is very much in their feelings. So I'm getting if in a past someone has walked away, then you were on their mind and they may have missed you a lot. And I feel that someone here could be very focused on their work, on their coins, that on their career, but at the back of their mind, they were thinking about you and I really feel that you both were missing each other even if you both were dis distracted your if you distracted yourself and your person also in work then you guys were trying to heal from this and you did not want to feel very alone but the thing is you both were thinking about each other you are inseparable 
that's how they view you someone could be blocked here and if it's a past energy maybe at present too someone is blocked or acting very defensive but I really feel that you are going to move on from this energy if you haven't already. So what is this two of cups? Because I feel... <laughs> this person really wants to have a family with you. Could be someone who is independent and single at the same time could be commitment phobic. This person really loves you. They would... They are thinking about it. They are really imagining themselves with you in a commitment or marriage so let's see i like to make you feel jealous because it gives me shirts just... <laughs> three of cups two of swords and the hangman i don't think they are dating anyone else even if they are saying that they have interest in someone else that is not the case because they are thinking about it a lot and they are very detached from other people. They are not talking much. This person is holding back and this person is just very comfortable where they are. And for some of you, it could be a third party situation, but I really feel that this person is acting very defensive and they are not dating other people. Even if they are saying this to you, that they are enjoying their life or they are dealing with others or they have many options this person have no interest i don't think this person is talking or have that interest in others because they just want to make you feel they just want to see whether you will act possessive or not or you are someone who can get upset or angry on such issues so could be a test but this person <coughs> I don't think they have interest in other people. You may feel that they have many options, but this person has no interest in that. This is four swords here and the hangman. This person is not doing much and ace of cups. They love you. They want to have a new start with you. Ace of cups twice in this reading. <coughs> don't ignore me. They feel that you are holding back from them. If not now, then could be at the end of this month or <clears throat> in the middle of this month but i feel this is related to passion this is possible that you are going to hold back from them physically and they don't want that they love you queen of cups is here this person really loves you what's happening here i feel you because i'm trying to protect you Justice with the Two of Pentacles. This person would want to do or take that action that is right for you and for them. They want to make a change, some change in their life or bring a change in this relationship. This person could be very confused and this is a time to make a decision. I ignore you because I'm trying to forget you. Let me clarify this one more. This person is afraid of a heartbreak, yes, and they feel that they, this is their destiny, this is their karma, that they don't get, that luck is not on their side, and they always get hurt, and they prefer to stay single, and they feel that it's better to stay single and emotionally independent from others, because this is not in their destiny to hold someone else's hand they are destined to stay alone that's what they feel this person is thinking a lot to be dealing with a libra justice card here or leo eight of wands they are going to talk about it with you there is a lot of communication here and page of swords and a lot of stalking if not stalking then this person is very curious to know what's there and this person wants to grab more information about it and they want to make a right decision i'm scared of relationships i told you i'm scared of relationships and i'm healing this person is commitment phobic they like to stay single and 
emotionally independent and i feel this person is financially stable as well magician card here they know how to manifest new things for them they know the power of manifestation also i feel that this person was yes this person was scared to manifest a relationship in their life this person was very really scared and now this is happening and when this is happening they feel that things are falling apart they cannot take it they love you and they know you love them too ace of cups here with the king of cups they still feel that unfinished business with you if you guys they have passion for you and they want a new start with you also with this tower card they are going something is going to change here and it's going to be very random and important change this person will let down his or her wall and will put work in this relationship they will manifest the sun card here <laughs> why are you watching this reading when things are very fine between you guys They are going to let their wall down. They are going to put work on this relationship. They will manifest this relationship and they will try to win over their fears. Fool card with the four of wands. They are going to take a risk to move in with you, to have union with you, to for some of you in marry you and healing peace. Queen of Cups, they love you, and Queen of Cups is a healer too. So, could it be possible that they, you, or them, are someone who heal you from this energy of feeling afraid? And Nine of Pentacles showing itself. This person, if this person or you was trapped in another relationship or in you were having some kind of heartbreak that you are still going through that and that's why you preferred to stay single it could be you or this person but i see healing here so they feel that you are healing and this relationship is very healing for you and for them as well but just apply it to your situation yes it is related to someone's past and Sag energy here could be dealing with a Sag or a water sign Scorpio and someone was feeling very betrayed someone gone have gone through a painful ending here and I feel that this person sees you as your soulmate and they feel a deep connection with you and this connection is very pure and I'm getting here that you both this is a past life relationship you could feel a deep connection with this person and it could be a past life relationship and things are going to move forward and they could view you as someone who is a player but who is charming and who likes to travel someone who knows how to use their words and someone who looks good and who has that vibe that you have a tendency to attract people towards you and that's it that's how they view you but this person loves you <laughs> ace of cups again and with the king of cups this is the couple isn't it beautiful this is an amazing read and I really feel there is no issue between you guys if there is then this person is very much in their feelings they love you and if things are not fine right now then they are going to come towards you because I see a lot of communication here and this person is very likes to keep things balanced and I really feel that they will take that action that is right for both of you and for this relationship also i feel i see a passion here and this i see love and i see a new start here so 
they see you as their partner and they know that you love them too and this connection is mutual and ace of rods again so expect passion what's going to happen between this person is has in the month of May there will be a lot of communication a lot of thinking and could be dealing with an Aries as well strong fire here so I feel you both are trying to keep things balanced between you and you both are thinking about it you both want to keep things keep a control over things and just take that action that is right you don't want to act impulsive and this is about both of you but ten of pentacles here you both are seeking commitment and long-term relationship marriage and yes balance and this is something this is a change that you guys are going through this is a change a big change and this relationship is going to transform here i really feel that for the month of may at least you guys are going to have great month i see love 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 here and passion okay so this was your reading sag i really hope it helped you thank you so much for watching bye bye and take care